Benjamin Franklin once wrote, The way to see by faith is to shut the eye of reason. But for a man with so many bright ideas, this last one is about as smart as attaching a key to a kite and flying it in a lightning storm. Franklin deserves praise for his many contributions to science and society, but on this matter the brain behind the bifocals is undoubtedly mistaken. How do I know? Franklin forgot to account for a Christian like me. Besides being a journalism major, I'm also earning a minor in philosophy, a field of study with a reputation of hammering the nail in the coffin for religious belief. In my case, instead of killing it, philosophy has instead invigorated my belief in God. I now have answers to some of the tough questions levied against Christianity. Reason has not supplanted my faith, but supplemented it. Both are intertwined around my essence and permeate my being. Hence, Franklin's quote precludes the possibility of a rational Christian. To him and many others, including unfortunately many Christians, I'm a contradiction in terms, a square circle or a married bachelor, but I think I know myself better than someone who isn't me. I'm not a violation of the laws of logic or an exception to the rule. There have been plenty of Christians like me that Franklin and others have overlooked. Faith didn't prevent Nicholas Copernicus from proposing that the Earth wasn't the center of the universe nor did it hinder Isaac Newton from discovering the laws of gravity. Faith just means to trust, and trust is not a dogmatic excuse to not think. I certainly can't prove that my faith is true, but I can certainly add weight to it via evidence. In actuality, there is little we can deduce as certain. Faith slash trust is proliferated in the human pursuit of knowledge. We trust the sun to rise every morning. It's possible it won't. But it's not irrational to assume it will because of scientific evidence. My Christian faith is akin to the belief that the sun will ascend tomorrow, and not to a blind leap in the dark. In the words of Galileo Galilei, I don't feel obliged to believe that the same God who has endowed us with senses, reason, and intellect has intended us to forego their use. Likewise, I do not feel obliged to believe that the same Benjamin Franklin who has endowed us with so many wise sayings caught lightning in a bottle with this one.